Logan Elephant Bar. Yes, I don't know if he's had a chance to train on a bar that's this, that's this uh, flexible. As we said, you've got to pull the bar in. To make his attempt, 796 pounds, and that will be no problem. And Belichick's first attempt is good. Favoring of one side or the other. Up next, Matthias Kalaszkowski from Poland. Another man who looks to be the future. You don't see very many guys use the sumo style. Let him hear it, 800 pounds! 796 looks great for Kalish. Koski is his first. Kilo's here checking it out. You can only imagine what's going through his head. Young athlete gets this chance. Here we go. Pardon me, 820. 820 is good for the youngster. Making a big jump from Alexei Novikov's 820. He's in the 1,000 pound club. Here we go. And Carone drops 904, maybe grabs his right hamstring there. And if you put weight on, you can't take it off. That is Ron O'Heinla out of Estonia, the 2018 Arnold Classic Australia champion. Making his second. I think it's a very smooth start. First attempt to Ron O'Heinla. And that will count. We'll get Pushes very quickly, very dynamic lift. He actually used the flex the bar a little bit differently. And then he actually pushes his feet down through the middle. Do a good job of scraping up your legs. Yes, it does. So uh, deadlift bars are known for that, any bar with, a, with, with flex in it. And what happens is that bar comes off the floor and goes right into your shin. You notice that he actually had the bar. A couple months ago in Santa Monica right there on the pier. 420 kilos for Lisi's. And that is no. It's not like a clean where you need your shoulders in front of the bar, and then you can, or a snatch where you need your shoulders in front of the bar to allow your, your push to your chain levers to get the bar accelerated. With a deadlift, you want to sit back. And again, let's see the effort on the ship leave off. No problem for Shivlikov. 950 in the books for him in his open it happens when, the, when there's more weight on the bar and what the crowd does for you and what a, what an athlete's mental aspect does for you that is brian shaw he has finished first or second here at the arnold strongman classic seven of the last eight years he was second left for brian shaw rattling that ball And that goes up easily. Watch how he rolls the bar back, flexes his hips down, and stands up very, very easily. That was a very commanding lift. Champion Hathor Bjornsson and the record holder in this event at 1,041 pounds. His opening attempt, five more pounds than Brian Shaw. He's going to go for 955. So that's number one, 955 pounds. Gravity is not a problem for that man with 950. Jerry's really playing inside of, of having the best placement possible. And it looks like he's going to take a big leap at the end to strike. He wants to get in that top three to strike at that 500 kilos as he is a, as a great deadlifter. We saw him pull 950 at Santa Monica, and it looked easier than his 700-pound pull. I, I think you might agree with that, Sean. He looked great at Santa Monica. He, does, he uses the, his lever of his hips and his back. Pritchett right to work in 974 go. Breaker segment, you look at this. Lift. Little, There's a good chance that'll a, happen. Yes, a little bit of a hip dip. Doesn't roll the bar back. But notice how he, he kind of looks down as he starts his pull. And what that allows him to do is just pull back, back, back. 59 pounds. Great lift for Kalis Koski. See if we can see where he might run into trouble. He really had to double hitch that just a little bit. That might have been what got him. So notice how his feet are also closer. To One of the top three spots. He's got to have a good performance in this event. Top three spots overall, that is. Alexei Novikov will be up next. He is the rookie. Novikov will 
get the lift. So two for two. 160 pounds. Machas told me he was born strong. Times worse as an apprentice chef. And probably hauls a lot of big objects around that restaurant. That's